just got my new Switch Pod. What's going on guys, Armando Gong here, back with another video, doing something new today, cause I just got my Switch Pod from Mr. Pat Flynn and Co. Um, it's my first unboxing video that I've ever done, and I'm kinda excited to see what's going on in this little Switch Pod. So, let's take a look. First thing that comes up in this box, you see, switch pot. Nice, I will look at this later. And also a little note. Thank you so much for being one of our Kickstarter backers and helping bring this dream to life. We couldn't have done it without you and we are so excited you are now have it in your hands, Caleb and Pat Flynn. A gift for our Kickstarter backers. If someone you know needs a switch pot in their gear bag or you want to gift one to a friend for the holidays, there's a special $10 off for every switch pot order at switchpod.com. Use coupon makes the switch. Oh, they have a referral program. If you're looking to share SwitchPod, we'd love to have you be a part of the affiliate program. So all referrals earn 10%. Sweet. So definitely signing up for that. And I think it's kind of, I think it's also nice that uh, Pat Flynn adding this in to help us, you know, li live that smart passive income life, you know. Big fan of his work and, you know, it's kind of exciting that he lets me do it. So let's take a look. Front of the box, looking pretty simple. Minimal switch pod, let's look at the sides. Just the switch pod lettering. Switch pod. I'm assuming this is the logo for it, so. Nice, easy instruction. Here's how switch pod works. Quickly attach any camera or ball head adapter with a tightening knob. Tightening grooves make it easy to hold. Switch between handheld and tripod modes in seconds and hold it in place. All right, let's open this up. Oh, magnetic, nice. Made for by creators, for creators. Kind of like this overall simplicity of this box or this packaging, nice. It's actually properly inserted into here. There you have it. Okay, nice. Pretty simple to use. Definitely could see myself using this a lot more. Pretty solid metal designs, nice finger grooves. For me, it feels pretty nice and easy to use. Like, it's actually nicely, properly angled. I was playing around with this some more. Definitely here to just screw in the stuff. Pretty solid construction. I think it's like aluminum. Always had it. one of the issues I have with my Gorilla Pod is that I don't really like balancing out the legs in terms of since it's so flexible. This kind of just saves an issue with that. So if I just like it's a little bit loud, like some of the other pre or prior reviews have said in terms of when you're making videos. But I don't think that's that big of an issue. I do wish that it came with a ball this ball joint already previously, but I guess I'll just something I'll have to buy. Looking at this some more, it's pretty solidly made. No complaints so far. I can't wait to just try it out and use it. Um, I'm a big fan of uh, Pat Flynn's work. He's uh, one of the biggest, if you don't follow his podcast on Smart Passive Income, or Ask Pack 2.0, I would highly suggest it. It's one of those podcasts I listen to every day to just get, find motivation and to just get started on the smart passive income life. Overall, I'm pretty happy with this. Um, I paid, I believe, 70 bucks or for this as a backer. And I, for one thing, it's actually easier to store and put in my bag than the original, than the Gorilla Pod. It's pretty easy, I'm using my phone to, to do this. It feels a little heavy, but I think that's just the nature of all handheld tripod vlogging cameras setups. Again, one thing I did not like about the Gorilla Pod is I have to kind of this 
setting it to make it do like this in order to do it. Oh, and I actually twisted it off this thing by accident, so that was completely unintentional. But popped it back in, but any selfie mode would have to be like this, whereas this is already angled to do that. So yeah, overall, I'm pretty happy with the SwitchPod. Um, I'm pretty glad that I bought into it when it first came out. Um, hopefully, I'll definitely go into use it more to make some more vlogging material and just use it to just film things more overall. It's easy to pack into my bag. It's super nice and flat. It doesn't really, not too clunky. Um, it feels okay on the wrist so far. This material is pretty solid. I don't see any issues with it breaking, honestly, compared to the Gorilla Pod, which I literally just snapped off by accident. Only issue I would like is for them to have added a ball joint, but I don't think that's a deal breaker in that sense. Um, other than that, I don't really have any complaints so far as I just literally got it, got it out of the box. I'm looking forward to using it. Um, thank you again, Pat and Kayla, for uh, sending it over here um, as one of the earlier backers, so I appreciate that. And looking forward to using it. I'm also going to sign up for the referral program. If you guys want to purchase your own SwitchPod, I'll leave my own affiliate link down below in the description box. And I'm so far digging it, I will post an update about it and after I've gotten more of a chance to use it. If you guys like this video, please give me a like and put the comment down below and I'll try to respond to them as much as I can. And share this video with everyone and subscribe and click the notification bell to hear more videos from my channel. That's all I got. Take it easy. I'll see you next time.